Hey, how's it going everybody? It's Pelo here. Welcome back to my channel. Good to see you guys again. And are you guys a big fan of Dolby Twins? I know I am. They are one of the biggest stars on TikTok and YouTube right now. As a matter of fact, I'm personally a subscriber. One of my favorite videos of theirs on TikTok would be this one right here. And after seeing this video, I was like, I have to subscribe to them. Also, I think Ivanita is also very cute and pretty. However, I'm not subscribed to her yet. Should I subscribe? I don't know. Let me know in the comment below, guys. Anyways, I've been watching their videos and recently they had a video called Pranking My Brother for 24 Hours. I don't know about you guys, but I just hate clickbait and I find it super annoying. It's just very misleading. It's like, imagine if someone goes to the supermarket to buy an apple and it looks really nice and fresh on the outside, but the moment you bite into it, it's a rotten on the inside and you immediately spit it back out. So I feel like I was baited into watching this video due to the title, uh, pranking his brother for 24 hours, right? And I was just like, this is not 24 hours. This is barely two hours. Like what? How can you guys put 24 hours on a title? But anyways, let's watch the video together. And as usual, I'll be just complaining about stuff. All right, let's go. I mean, first of all, I just want to say, oh my god, that's a huge blower. And since you guys have almost 17 million subscribers, why do you guys still have to resort to uh, clickbaiting? You know, it's like, this is something reserved for people like me. You know, I only have like, what, 36 subscribers. Yeah, I mean, this is something that I need to do. Not for you, man. You already have 17 million subscribers and you're still scamming people? Like, what? I just don't understand this. Like, this is the part I don't really understand, right? Like, you literally just left the room and you're gonna ask your cameraman if your brother's awake? Like, have you not seen your brother? I mean, he was literally just sleeping, like, what, a second ago? And you don't know he was sleeping? Like, I mean, like, obviously your brother went back to sleep. He doesn't want to be bothered. Um, so, I mean, if you haven't got that message from the earlier interaction, then I don't know what you were doing in there. Well, just brushes his teeth after he wakes up, so? That's what I'm about to do. Right. I'm about to put food coloring on his toothbrush and all of his teeth are going to be green. Yeah, he's going to hate you today. You know that, right? I'm pranking him for 24 hours. Let's go. Right, go inside. Go inside. Open the window for me. Right, come on. Oh, that's I don't know if you guys heard it earlier. He just said it again. He's going to prank his brother for 24 hours. And this... This is the part that I don't understand, right? I mean, like, obviously your brother's sleeping and, you know, you send the camera person to go in from the front door. Why would you just follow the camera person and just walk in from the front door? What is the point of having him going from the front door, opening the door, go inside and opening the back window for you just so you can climb in? I mean, it's the same thing. Am I going crazy here or like, this whole thing just doesn't make sense to me. God, 
Guys, those are some cute ass toothbrush shoulders. Oh my god, I just cannot get over them. I think the last time I used one of those was probably 10 years ago. I thought everyone would be using one of those electric ones, you know, the ones that you can get from Costco. You know, the ones that you see at Costco all the time, you know, 100 bucks for two or something. But I love it, I love it so much. <laughs> you gotta be patient, guys, you gotta be patient. Yeah. See? What if he sleeps for another two hours? Like, we don't know. I don't know, bro. We're just gonna have to wait. wait. Yeah. yeah, we're just gonna have to wait. Here he's here. You recording? He's here. He's here. Oh, yeah. Like, I seriously wonder how long did they have to wait outside just to wait for the brother to wake up? What if he doesn't wake up for like five hours? So, are you guys just gonna be standing outside and just wait for him to come into the restroom? <laughs> how does that work? Oh, you Who thinks Marcus actually looks like a girl right now? Like he looks so metro right now. He looks like one of those emo gothic girls. <laughs> With all the makeup on. Like if somebody gives him a wig right now and he just puts on some girl's clothing, nobody will be able to tell that he's actually a guy. I don't know about you guys, I mean, who's getting a headache from watching this video just because their camera is just so shaky all the time and then, you know, with the zoom in and the zoom out and obviously they're not using a stabilizer. So just like very shaky footage. So if I were to focus on watching this video, like I would get like a slight headache sometimes just because it keeps shaking and I, I don't know, maybe I suffer from a little bit of the motion sickness or something. Prank him anymore? Well, oh no. There's 50 more pranks. Let's get it. Yeah, so I just cooked Marcus some really good food here. And there's no way that you made that Chinese food. Look at that. It looks so professional. It looks like you guys just order a takeout from a Chinese restaurant. They just deliver it to your house. And maybe you literally just microwaved it for like a minute. You For sure, you did not make that Chinese dish right there. There's no way that you would have been able to cook that by yourself. Tasty Chinese food because it's really sick. And basically, Steve, you're going to give it to him. And right when you hand it to him, I'm going to air horn him. And boom, I'm gonna prank him, I'm gonna scare him. Bro, are you serious? Yeah. Alright, um, I just put the, the camera down. Put the camera down, but I, or should I give it to him? No, you need to give it to him. I'll give it to him, and you wait in that corner. Alright, alright. Yo, yeah, Marcus! Marcus! Yo! Yeah. Yo, yeah, Marcus! Yo, yeah, Marcus, um, we, we gave you some hot... Uh... Have you guys seen the movie Rock of Ages? Like the camera person just reminds me of Alec Baldwin um, that was playing Dennis Dupree in Rock of Ages. And I'll show you guys a little footage so you guys can get the reference. <laughs> I think he just looks hilarious. <laughs> Recording. Uh, <laughs> what, I t what I told you. Alright, alright, alright. Ah! Clean that up. Alright. He literally threw the food in the air. Yeah, bro, you made him jump. That was good, that was good. So, right now, Marcus is with my dad, and I'm about to cut his hair off. Bro. Hold up, hold up. There is no way that you're cutting Marcus' hair off. Like, I don't believe you, man. There's no way. Like, you can pay me a million bucks, you can give me all your Ferraris and Lamborghinis, but I just don't believe you. Oh, what? He literally is gonna hate us for this entire day. I actually have fake 
curly hair here, so he's definitely going to freak out, you know? Yeah, I'm ready. <laughs> You're going to make him have his hair. I'm going to be like this. And he's just going to be falling apart like that. And he's going to think it's his hair. Whoa, 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 that was just so fake. I mean, honestly, like, the clipper wasn't even turned on. There was no buzzing sound. Like, <laughs> that was just so fake. You look so staged. I mean, like, I don't understand who in the right mind would actually believe that. Like, just someone does something, like, you know, to the back of your head. Like, you know, it didn't even make a sound, right? And you believe someone cut off your hair with a clipper? Like, no way. There's no way. I ordered something from Amazon, but it's not going through. What? I just want to say 2019. Who the hell calls into Amazon anymore? There's live chat that you can just go on there and instantly talk to one of the agents. I mean, I'm an old fart, and even I don't call them anymore. So what the heck are you doing, Marcus? Is this staged? Because it looks very staged to me. <laughs> Margaret just looks like he shot it in his pants and all the nasty stuff just came out. <laughs> He's in the front door, front door, front door. Oh! Oh! Wait, what? That's it? That's the end of the video? Well, I'm depriving your brother for 24 hours. Like, what's the deal, man? Why'd you scam me like that? That was only like what, like five or six pranks. The video was like 13 minutes. How's that 24 hours? That's more like an hour or two hours. <laughs> Come on, Dobe twins. And that's it guys, that's the end of the video. Um, I'm a little bit disappointed. I'm actually slightly annoyed by the extremely shaky camera work and mildly irritated by the lack of content here. Please let me know what are your thoughts and leave a comment in the comment section below. If you guys like the video, please like and subscribe, and uh, I will see you guys next time. Peace!